Now we we have a, we need to, the people are starting to grow less interested. We need to throw something out there that is going to make them not only cry but laugh. If I can throw out a video idea, okay. Yeah, pretty simple. Let's pretty bounce basic. some ideas okay. off each other. Yeah, you can say it. This is like, it. Don't touch. This is not a judgment free zone. But so, okay. Me, on a swing set, rocking back and forth and back and forth, and who comes up behind me but Jeremy? And Jeremy leans in close and whispers in my ear, Hey, coach. And I was like, coach? I look at him and I say, what do you mean, coach? I'm not your coach. Jeremy says, oh, you have no idea how much of a coach you've been to me my whole life. You are truly a man. Yeah, I don't get it, though. Why am I your coach? And Jeremy gets down on his knees, looks at me, and I say, what are you doing? You're proposing? And Jeremy says, no, I'm not proposing. I have news. What news? Jimmy, this is hard. Your wife is dead. I say, no, she's not dead. She's not dead. She's fine. I just, I just talked to her on the phone. She's fine. And Jeremy says, no, she's dead. Jimmy, she's not dead. She's not. Look, I just talked to Jimmy. She said she's to talk to her. Jeremy says, Jimmy is over. She's dead. And I get, and there was an accident. There was no saving her. They tried, Jimmy, they tried. I don't get what they tried. They took my wife from me. My wife and my everything, and now I don't have anything. <laughs> and just as we're talking, a man comes over, Zach, and Zach comes over in a very ang very angrily and says, I'm the man who killed your wife! How could you do this to me, to my family? You've taken my wife, you son of a bitch! Do it, you f***ing hit me! And I said, I can't f***ing hit you, I'm sorry. <laughs> and then Jeremy breaks us up and he says, April Fools! <laughs> Can I, like... Take that a little. Absolutely. I don't see anything wrong with it. But the I mean, thing with that is, for at least four minutes of it, pretty sad. <laughs> yeah, well, it's funny. It, it's sad. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but I don't, I don't that's think, the new funny. I don't think that's it's a, very dark. You, the punchline just comes so late in the story that it doesn't. Yeah, it doesn't really work. You should just let Jeremy say his. No. Since like, okay, okay. So we see a boy laying in bed. The camera is over him. The boy is me. He opens his eyes, and he gets up. And he's wearing a spider costume, because he's a superhero. Spider boy. Mm. Spider boy? Yeah, spider boy. It's like original, you know? Nothing like that ever. Yes, very original. So, spider boy. He swings his legs over the, the bed. He stands up, pulls his pants up. He walks up to his car, his supermobile. It's a real, real intense car in his real intense costume. I feel like it's just gonna be Zach's car. Right. So he picks up his phone and he says, Z-Man, I'm wait, on my way. Wait, who's Z-Man? Who's playing Z-Man? You are, Jimmy. Oh, oh, right, right, right. His nickname's the Tutu. Right. Yeah. So he says, I'm on my way. Where are you? He says, I'm by the corner. He gets in his car, slides over his hood, and suddenly we're taken to the corner where Z-Man is standing on the corner in his lovely costume. On top of it, or just in the general area? On the corner, you know. Doesn't answer so much. Just great. So he's standing there, and he says, get in. He goes to get in the car. But who comes out of the bushes, bud? Who? The supervillain. Spark Notes. Spark Notes? Yeah, he's a literary genius turned supervillain. Why is he a villain? I don't know. He's terrible and evil. And what does he do? Spoil book endings? No, he doesn't. No. He's just... He uses he's fire. Spark notes. Right, because he's a literary genius. Uh-huh. Okay? So, he comes out of the bushes, grabs the man and throws him to the ground. And then he comes around the car, he grabs him and he says, You've spun your last web, boy. He strangles him, and okay? And then he cracks his neck. Oh! And Sparknotes runs away. He can't fly? No, he can just, you know, read real fast. Oh. And then Z-Man comes over out of his agony and he says, Spider Boy, what can I do? How can I help you? Spider Boy says, Call nine one. 
and he takes his last breath. Oh. And Z-Man doesn't know who to call. So, the moral of the story is, don't be a superhero if you don't got the talent. So that's... Right, no punchline. No, there was a punchline. He didn't know who to call. The joke me. was... It was gonna kill him. It was me, like, it's like, so obvious he should call 911. Right. Exactly. That's right. funny. But also, the joke throughout is that they're not very good at being superheroes. Guys, alright. Alright, so... This idea, kind of ambitious, but also <coughs> very funny, very heartwarming. Oh. We fade in from black on two silhouettes standing in front of a sunset. Then we cut to Jeremy, bald. He looks at the sun, and then Jimmy looks up at him covered in Jeremy's hair, and he says, Father, why? Jeremy kneels down. Never make a bet on your hair, because then you'll have a devil to pay. Oh. Get it? That's a yeah. pretty good joke, right? It's yes. Good. I need to think of like the rest of the story, but... It's really artsy. Yeah, yeah it's I mean, like, like, like really good visuals. And so, like, very Spielberg. I was very just Spielberg. about to say that. Yeah, so Reminds obviously we can't do it because we can't do Spielberg. Way to go, Zach. Anyway, this is black screen. White text goes across the screen. How do you done do that? Please tell me why. Dot JPEG. All in Comic Sans. Fades away. We see the great Rick Moranis, played by Zach, obviously. Mm -hmm. Now, Rick Moranis is walking in a circle very fast, really, really quickly, and then he stops and says, ooh! And he holds out his hand, ooh, the bench. And he walks over and sits on the bench. He's thinking with his Rick Moranis grin, mm -hmm. who happens to walk by but his son, Dick Moranis. Now, Dick Moranis is a Dick Moranis. He's wearing a tank top, and a snapback, and he doesn't care much for his father. And he looks at his dad, and without hesitation, goes, What's up, Dick Splash? And, you know, who would say that to their dad? Rick Moranis says, Hi, you doing, son? Dick Moranis says, None of your business. I don't love you anymore. Rick Moranis stands up, looks his son in the eyes, and says, Sorry, I couldn't have been there. And proceeds to turn his head into the sunlight, and with a dramatic grin, he says, I was destined for something greater. And runs. Rick Moranis is running really fast, extremely fast. And his son, in sheer awe of how fast his father is running, bursts into flames, falls to the ground going, Woo! Woo! Rick Moranis turns around, sees his son, smiles with that Rick Moranis smile of his, holds his fist up high, and says, Honey, I beat the kids. It's a high-budget movie. You know, yeah. costumes and everything. Costumes, craft services. We couldn't do that. Yeah. Okay, so if you, we have, it's down to you. Yeah. If you don't have anything, I'm thinking we just quit. All right, so boy runs into his room, crying. He's like so upset. I just wish my life was more like the movies. And then he goes to bed because he's he's sad. He wakes up, and when he speaks, it's not words. It's it's a movie quote sound bites from movies and that's how they talk because the kid he loves these movies what? and no, it's so fun no zach it's, nope. no no not it's just okay it's one not, thing people don't even watch movies anymore it's not a bad it's not a bad idea all right i'm not saying it's a bad idea i am that's it's a bad idea yeah, jimmy sounds like compared to what me and jimmy had been saying yeah it's not good but i think that'd be really fun like it's cool it's, the, people it's love movies not a bad idea but, no one loves movies i don't know a single person but every single video idea we've had yeah should end like this the video ends, and then it cuts to the logo, and it says, Three Amigos, Comedy. And then we do an After Three Amigos title screen, where I go, Suck it to me, fuck, 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 shit. Right? Fuck, 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 Wu-Tang Clan. Ah! And here's last week's video. Mm -hmm.